Big Run Production. What's poppin' y'all? It's your big homie MC Ron Ski. And do I even know, do I even have to um, even say who I got on the right and the left of me? I really don't, but you know what? I'm gonna let them introduce themselves first, man. On my left, I got. You already know it's your boy Milltown Blow Stick Day, Eat Me with some Lions. Already. And on my right, I got. Drake Dennis, didn't know. Wild Boys, Jersey shit, man. That's what's up. Got my man over here with me, man. You know what I'm saying? Midwest Alliance, Drake Dennis, Milltown Blow. Your big homie MC Ron Ski. VOG, No Chill, No Filter TV. Check this out, man. We just gonna jump right into it. I need a recap. Just, just a quick recap of yesterday, man. Who did you battle? I battled Killer B. Okay. Black Ice Cartel. Okay, okay. And what would you say about that battle, man? How you, how you rating it? I mean, it was a good battle. Mm -hmm. Most people say we had a battle of the night. Okay. So, um, first, first round he came out, he was swinging, but in the beginning of his round. Okay, okay. So my first round was probably my best round. So convincingly he took the first, second round, might edge it to him, and then he come down to the third. So okay, okay. So we just gotta check it yeah, out. Yeah, it was it was a good back and forth battle. Like it was a dog fight. So cool. That cool. shit gonna be crazy. Yeah, I definitely want to see that. Um, so just real quick, man. Like just a recap of the whole night, man. Who did Charlie Clips battle? He had Danger Zone. Okay, okay. And that what was, was a crazy one. Was it? Yeah, it was who you, crazy. Who you got taken? I gave it the clips two one. Okay, okay. But Danger came with it. It's it's a preference battle. Right, right. So uh, clips he had the performance. Danger he was more bar heavy. So okay, it depends on what you like. Okay, cool, cool. And I definitely I gotta see that one too because I did see a little bit of little bit of footage footage from um, <laughs> he was out there um, kind of like playing around with oh, my, from my guy. Yeah, yeah. With my bar. And that was that was that was sick. That was sick. I liked that. So. Um, I, I, I just, I gotta ask this, man. Akirion and YP, did they battle? They did battle, right? I think they was like yeah. the first one. Maybe. Yeah. What happened? Um, <laughs> there was some choking. Oh, there was no. Some choking in that battle. No. Um, oh, 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 don't tell me that, man. Yeah, it was. Oh, oh, yeah, so oh, it was no. kind of slaughtered. So. Oh, okay, so, aside from the choking, who took it? Whichever one had the dreads. <laughs> oh, uh, carry on. Carry on. My yeah, little he dope. Had some shit. He had some shit. Yeah, carry on, dope. He dope. He yeah. dope. That's for sure. That's for sure. Okay, man. So I did a little bit of research on you, man. And um, I gotta ask you, man. You you did go to uh, was that was that like a was like was that like a, a gimmick battle with uh, Nick Cannon? Nah, <laughs> it it wasn't a gimmick battle. Basically. I'm gonna, I'm gonna break it all. I was just finna say, because you're gonna, you gonna have down. to do that. No chill, no filter, man. What's happening? Because yeah, you know I got man. a couple more questions on that. Yeah, I'm gonna break it down. So, you got slaughtered, man. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't a gimmick battle. We was on there competing to be on the show. Okay. So, basically, whoever got the most votes that night mm -hmm. was supposed to go to the, the final round and then compete. And the winner out of that would get on the show. Right. So, in the beginning, because you had to do audition tapes and all that, so right. I was killing it. Right. Got to it easy. So, they set the rules. Originally, they said we had to prepare shit for our opponent and Nick Cannon. Right. So, I'm preparing for all of them. Mind you, when they told us we could be in it, it was two days before the show. Ah. It was Monday. Okay. And the show was on Wednesday. Oh. So we only had a couple days, so I'm preparing for all of them. So I had my shit. I'm all I'm all pumped. <laughs> I'm all pumped. They got the day of we in there and they got uh the music playing and shit. I'm rapping my shit in my head to different beats. I'm like, yeah, I can do this. I'm good. I ain't gonna fuck up. So Last minute, they tell us, all right, you only go up in the cannon. Oh. So I'm like, all right, fuck it. But 
automatically I'm thinking like, damn, I could have just been prepping for him. Right, right. And they were only prepping for him. They right. didn't write nothing for me. Right, right. So I'm the only person that, you know, at the end of the day, is no excuses, but I'm breaking it. I, I just want you. Right. Just I want y'all to know, yeah, okay. everything that happened. So, okay. all right, so I'm like, so they, them two go, they were both trash. And then I'm in the hallway, I'm practicing my shit, I'm about to go. And the cannon walks past me, he was like, yeah. All you gotta do is not fuck up. It was trash. <laughs> like you got it. You got it. Just don't fuck up. Right. So I'm like, yeah, I'm real pump. I'm like, yeah, I'm about to win this shit. I'm like So I go in there and it's my turn. So the beat started a little low. Mm -hmm. I ain't gonna lie, the beat was a little low. So I had to catch it. And I fucked up. I flat out fucked up my first bar. So, I'm like, uh, I'm like, all right, fuck it. So, I'm, I'm going to just start back at the top. Tried to go back into it, and I fucked it up again. And then at that point, I just tried to freestyle. Right. And it was it was all downhill. So uh, yeah, man, I, mean, I, can, I can vouch for that and, one. <laughs> and mind you, this was, this was like 20 seconds. Right. Like, we didn't have a long time. Like, right. we were supposed to spit eight bars. Right. So, that's that's not a long time. So, this shit went by like that. Right. So, before I before I e could even think about it, the shit was over. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I'm standing there like, nah. Like, it didn't just end like that. Yeah. So, what most people don't know, right after DC walks up to me, Conceited walks up to me, he like, yo, what happened? <laughs> I'm like, yo, I don't know. Like, just blocked you, man. I just fucked up. Like, I wasn't nervous. Right. Like, I prepared. I know my shit. I just fucked up. And then I just start rapping my shit for them. Right. And they like, yo, like, why couldn't you just do that? And I'm like, yo, I don't know. Like, I just, <laughs> wow. I just fucked up. So. Then they go and get Chico Bean, and they like, yo, spit your shit. So I spit it for him, and they like, yo, all right. So they, they went to the producer, and they was like, all right, we're going to do something we never did before. We're going to let you do your shit over. Right. This is not going to be on TV, but it's going to be for the online footage. Right. So I'm like, all right, cool. So I do my shit. And I, I cook, like I got my shit off, like right. they fuck with me, right. but it wasn't on TV. Uh, okay, so okay. it's online though, like they put it on the uh, on the website, but it wasn't on live TV. So, okay. so the crazy thing is, I won the voting, like the online voting. I got the most votes. Okay, but before before it even got to that, the producer told us the voting is. Just for show. Mm -hmm. Like at the end of the day, Nick Cannon was gonna pick who won. Okay. So and he picked the girl. So that's oh, why okay. I didn't even win, even though I won the vote. Now can I find that online? Would you um, would you uh, actually the footage of you actually um actually cooking? Yeah. To get in? Yeah. yeah. Okay, yeah, check it. Yeah, we're gonna check that out, man, when it's all said and done, man. That's cool. So, man, I mean, um, like, just as far as battling is concerned, man, I'm pretty sure you got plenty of them, but, you know, you got an exact number of how many wins you got under your belt? Um, I mean, I got 62 battles. Woo! Yeah, you got a history then. Yeah, I got 62. I still got, like, six that haven't dropped yet, but right. they're they're from, like, maybe a month ago. Oh, okay, month, yeah. A month and a half ago. A second then. Yeah, so they're just not trying to drop too many of my battles at the same time. Right, right. But, um, I say, I ain't gonna say I won every battle. Right. I say I won a good, out of 62, I say I won a good. Let's do percentages. Out of 100% of your battles, what, what type of percentage do you think that you came in? I say like 93. Oof, that's a high percentage. Yeah. <laughs> I say like hey, he was quiet at first. What you got right. to say, man? That's good <laughs> shit. Bro, that, that's a lot of battles. So out of 62, that's saying I lost maybe like six. I'm saying clear losses, 
I ain't debatable. We you can't call them bosses. <laughs> yeah, I've been cooking niggas. Right. I, mean, I, I, you know, I, I did, I did, I did some research, and hey, the ones that I seen, yeah, you, you definitely, definitely got off. I didn't finish the one with you and clean paper. I'm going to definitely finish that one because both of y'all was getting off on that one. I mean, and honestly, you know, I can honestly say I wasn't a huge fan of clean paper until like maybe like a month or so ago when I actually saw him get off. And he was, yeah, yeah, yeah. I definitely, I can, yeah, I can, I can definitely vouch for that man. He definitely got my step on that. So, I mean, what's, what's next for Dre Dennis though? I mean, I'm on tour. I'm on tour. I had 18 battles this year. Damn, already? Yeah, yes, yesterday was number 18. Well, wow. Tell them what you did before that, because I don't think they understand the tour or the, the, the grind. Tell them about that. Man, I'm trying to I'm trying to pass DNA's record, man. Really? He had 26 battles this year. I mean, already? He, no, he had 26 battles two years ago, and that's the record for the most in the year. So, I mean, this is only July. So. I got 18. So I'm. I didn't take this this many battles just to pass it. Right, but right. since I'm doing it, I'm right, like, might as well get a goal right, on it. Set a goal. Tell them about, goal. Tell them about Saturday. Yeah, I had a battle on Saturday. What Block it? City. Oh, okay. Versus Ishmula, and then I battled yesterday. Versus oh. Killer B on Black Ice. So Saturday and Sunday, you have battles back to back. Back to back. And then so, I battle on Friday, this Friday, right. against uh, Michael Ice on Alpha League. Wow. Where's that at? In Detroit. So, oh, okay, okay. So, yeah, you, you booked across the Midwest right now, huh? That's what's yeah, up, man. Anyway, man. That's what's up, man. I'm glad I had you on my show. You's a very busy man. So, when this one here drop, man, y'all gonna have a nice little old treat on this one. I got some questions oh, for him. Oh, yeah, yeah. man. Um, so... Uh, let's talk about, you know, prior engagement as far as your career. Um, explain your situation with URL so the, so the people know exactly, you know, what you got going on as far as right now and why you aren't on URL right now. All right, so with, with URL, well, first of all, with me as a battler, everybody knows that I got crazy work ethic, even if niggas don't fuck with me and how I rap. They, they respect my grind. So, I'm somebody that promotes my battles. Before battles, I'm doing different shit. I'm doing kisses. I'm, I'm talking shit online. Like, I promote everything I do. So, URL will always fuck with me. Like that about me. So, with URL, the main issue with them was the fans weren't gravitating towards me. They're like, like you, we think you're nice, you never give us any trouble, but the fans aren't liking you the way we want them to, and we can't give you the plates that we know you deserve because we can't benefit from them with the fans feeling this way about you, so I'm like, I can respect that, and I understand that, like, I'm, I'm smart, like, I know how the game is, so I'm not going to be naive and just be like, nah, I'm the best nigga ever, so, you know, like, I'm not even like that, so, we decided to, they was like, just do your thing, get hot on other leagues, um, get that demand back, and then we going to bring you back, okay. so, that's what's happening right now, that's why y'all see me going crazy, right, oh, hell yeah, yeah, you definitely... You're definitely building that content. Yeah. So URL in, in itself is like an entity that you can actually go see an individual or is it like a room full of people that say, hey, this is what we're doing? I mean, you have a few people that that call shots over there. It's okay. not just one person. Right. So it's a handful of people. So Okay. Okay, well, And they all have like the same control. So. Okay, as platforms are concerned, um, when, when, when we talking to platforms, and, I, and when I say platforms, I mean like, from from like the the smallest to the to the biggest, what bracket you think you in? I mean, are you in that bracket where we talking like DNA and you know what I'm saying Charlie Clips and all them cats? Are you in that bracket yet, or are you are you maybe like either a step below it or? How, how I mean, I'm in my own lane. Right. That's really what it is. I feel like 
I'm somewhere between mid tier and top tier. Okay. Because you can look at my resume, you can look at my views, my the names, the amount of battles, everything, every category that you would compare battles battlers with. Mm -hmm. I'm high in it. I have crazy names that I battle. I have a lot of battles. I have a lot of views. So I'm one of them battlers. You see me get booked everywhere for a reason. Right. Leagues know that I prepare every battle. I don't come on with no bullshit. Right. I'm not hard to deal with. And I'm always going to promote everything. A lot of battlers will get paid and not do shit but come and rap. Right. They That's barely so share the battle. They they barely hype the battle up before the battle. Right. They, they don't even want to share the flyer half of the time. So... They know that I'm going to do all the little things to, to help shit out. Oh, okay. So, cool, cool. so, I think you should go ahead and tell the people too. Tell them about your KOTD experience. And what you got coming with that as well. KOTD, beautiful. What's up? Yeah, I was on Glove Up 2 in Detroit. I battled times. Uh, we was main event. And we had a dope ass battle. It's dropping. I, I don't want to give you all the wrong date, but I think it's July 29th, so okay. it's coming soon, and it's dropping on the main page, King of the Dot. The battle was crazy. It was in Detroit, and Times is from Detroit, so, you know, he was home. He got a little more love, like, you know, they they wanted to see him do good. Right. Me being there, they, if I'm good, that's great for the event, but if I'm not, they don't give a fuck. Right. But so they was they was hyped that I came with it and I didn't bullshit with it. So they definitely showed me love. So that's why I'm hyped to go back next week against Michael Ice. But man, man next week you just next week don't man. play so full right nah, now. Nah, I mean this week I'm, I'm forgetting it's Monday, so right. Friday. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You got to remember because yeah, I guess things is yeah things is kind of moving them right along, right? Yeah. Yeah, and, that, and that's cool, man. I'm glad you is getting work like that, man. I mean, from what I see, you deserve it, man. He actually the only battle rapper outside of Flips right now. Mm -hmm. It's like actually a tool. Right. That can like, take back when I can have a battle Friday and then have a battle Saturday. Oh, okay. Possibly can have a battle Sunday. You know what I'm saying? Like right. Like back to back in three different states. There's not too many artists that can really do that and be fully prepared. And if they not, still can be able to put on a good show and the show that they not Right, right. You know what I'm saying? So I salute, right. I salute you, bro. That for sure. Definitely, man. Five different times this year, I've either battled twice on the same day or back to back days. Five times this year. Yeah, man. Honestly, that's crazy. that's top tier work, though. For real. That that's from what I hear, man. That's that's top tier work. So when you leave here, when you when you hit the plane today, when you're on your way, so you going back home and chill, and then going to uh, the KOTD. Demonstration? No, he already did that. Yeah, oh, I already, already did. did. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, it's Alpha League in Detroit. So, oh, yeah. okay, okay. Cool. Yeah, I'm in cool. Jersey till for four days, and then I'm back in Detroit. So you ready for that? And a week after that, I got Connecticut. No, I'm not <laughs> ready for that. Either. Well, at least I'm he keeping written, it real. He keeping it real. I mean, and but I do this. Right. Like, this is what I do. Like sure. I can prep fast. So, so sure. people can't even tell that. I wrote shit last minute because I always got ideas. Right. But when it's time to lock in, that's when I write right. Okay. Okay. Well, yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm guessing you got your work cut out for you, brother, because mm -hmm. they, they definitely got you played super full right now. They, they got you. They got you working right now. That's cool. So, um, <clears throat> we we going we gonna to ask this man. Here are a couple questions, man, then we're going to wrap it up because I really need you and Ms. The Great Man to come on the show. Gotcha. Um, and I, I, I definitely want to want to kick it with y'all, man. But Midwest Alliance, man, I mean, how how is it how is it, how is it rocking right now, man? Everything all good? Yeah. I mean, obviously it is. You got one of the men with you. Mm -hmm. oh, boy. Midwest Alliance is, you know, we, we blessed, man. Right now we just focus on a lot of things that we have cool. coming up. You um, will see him on that card, um, actually. Okay. Uh, he, he battled uh, Gage from Chicago. Okay, okay. Um, so he'll be back in the bar in October. Um, but, you know, other than that, man, we just refocus and we actually about to drop another card. We're doing that there August 26th. Okay. Um, we're doing the card just to get a warm up. You know, we have a search for, for more talent. So this card is basically a card that we put together full of some dope artists that we, you know, we look 
looking for, you know, looking towards, you know, investing to you know, oh. building up, you know, for the future for the world. So we're on the search for that right now. So outside of that, we we all focus. You know. Cool, cool. Well, you know, no chill, no filter TV is with you, bro. You know That's what I'm that. saying? I'm, I'm definitely with you, man. I'm, I'm glad you, you know what I'm saying? You, you you looked out for me on this situation right here. So, um. You know, well, yeah, man, I guess that's what's going on then, man. And y'all just heard it straight from the horse's mouth on my right, man. Look, once again, brother, I definitely appreciate you taking the time to come through, man. I know you're a very busy man and you didn't have to do this, but I'm definitely glad you did, brother. Man, on behalf of No Chill, No Filter TV, man, I definitely appreciate you. You too, brother, definitely. You know what I'm saying? So we definitely, we're going we to do some work, man. So <clears throat> once again, man, it's been your big homie, MC Ryan Ski, VOG, with my dude, Milltown Flow. Dre Dennis, you know what I'm saying? We sat here, chopped it up for a minute. Y'all see what the man got going on. Follow him, you know what I'm saying? Or as a matter of fact, you want to tell him where to find you? I mean, I'm everywhere. I am Dre Dennis, so. And y'all, 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 y'all want to see me like right man. Uh, I battle so much, y'all. Y'all gonna get tired of seeing. That's what's up. That's what's up. And I'm glad, you know. Now this gonna be a part of his. This gonna be a part of his record right here. This gonna be a part of his resume. His face is on this also. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna tell you, you got the first official interview with him actually talking regarding the whole wild and out. Mm, that's on the wild Oh, okay. Next time, stay upset. Hey.